Hey Crypto Growth Fam, how's it going? This is your host Shazib signing in. We're back with another video on utility coins. This is group 4. We're going to be doing the updates, discussion, news regarding LCX, Nexera, Corium, Sologenic and IOTA. Uh, we're going to be looking at their price as well at the end of the video. It is going to be an interesting video, so stay tuned and watch till the end. So uh, for those of you who are new to the channel, folks, we primarily discuss utility coins. You guys can see the coins that we discuss regularly in this uh, channel as well as other potential gems as well. So if you're interested in them, make sure to stay tuned and subscribe for regular videos. So guys, uh, let us begin. Let us check what uh, LCX has been up to. Let us look at LCX. Latest news on LCX. Latest updates, discussions. Let us see what the CEO has been saying. So this is the official Twitter X handle of uh, LCX. LCX is an all-encompassing, regulated, secure and compliant blockchain ecosystem altering the crypto landscape game. LCX is your one-stop solution for a secure investment in diverse dig digital assets. Uh, in the LCX ecosystem, the native utility token is LCX token. This ERC20 token serves various purposes such as reducing trading fees, participating in token sales, and accessing exclusive features and products available at the LCX exchange. You can buy now exchange.lcx.com. Register to be a part of a uh, regulated crypto platform. LCX reposted. This is Monty, Monty Metzger. Let us see what he's saying. So, so basically, they also uh, they're working as a role, uh, working in the role of physical validator as well. This means that uh, LCX becomes the guarantor that your physical assets, like in the case of diamonds, there are real diamonds involved, and LCX bec becomes that physical validator that yes, uh, uh, real diamonds are present in their vault. So you, it is the directly convertible between physical and digital assets. So. Uh, LCX is innovating and basically the front runner in the tokenization of things, of assets. Tokenization is potentially a big deal industry, uh, big deal. Industry experts have forecast up to $5 trillion in tokenized digital securities trade volume by 2030. There are different figures. Uh, some say it will go well beyond $5 till 2030 as well. So there are various figures. Uh, let us also look at uh, the CEO's Twitter handle. Okay, so this is 20 hours ago. TIA, TIA, diamonds, ti uh, TIA rewards received with every diamond can be encashed immediately, used as a discount on the next purchase. Join the LCX community on social media and stay in the loop with the latest LCX news and insights. Buckle up for the next level of innovation, Web 4.0 will bring us autonomous agents, virtual reality and seamless integration of the physical and digital realms. Okay, LCX integrated the Bitcoin Lightning Network. This integration facilitates faster deposit and withdrawal of BDC, offering LCX users enhanced speed compared to traditional transactions, withdraw Bitcoin through Lightning Network. This is diamonds from unmatched hardness to exceptional conductivity. Diamonds are not just dazzling gems, but a testament to Earth's geological creativity. Upgrade to digital ownership with diamonds. LCX sponsored the next uh, Crypto Gem TV show. The next uh, Crypto Gem puts the best projects in the wild world of cryptocurrency to the ultimate test. Each week, expert judges challenge the teams to explain their projects. Okay, so this is. Cool. This is innovative. Uh, LCX earned tokenized bonds are a revolutionary financial instrument that combines the benefits of traditional bond bonds with the flexibility and transparency of blockchain technology. This is a thread. Join the financial evolution. LCX earns tokenized bonds are a prime example of how blockchain is reshaping traditional finance with enhanced accessibility, liquidity, security, and the potential for passive income. Investors are given new ways to explore and grow their wealth. Embrace the future of finance with LCX Earn. 
risk management, LCX Earn strikes a balance between risk and reward. The tokenized bonds provide a degree of stability with 7% return, PA, and thus even investors wary of the crypto market's volatility can reap the benefits of investing in blockchain-based assets. Public blockchain ensures data integrity uh, and security through a distributed network of nodes, making it nearly impossible to tamper with records. Read LCX.com introduction. Okay, so this is the regulated, transparent, and secure cryptocurrency exchange. In these uncertain, uncertain times, investors need to look for regulated exchanges that can provide a greater security, segregated, segregated funds, LCX ideas to Liechtenstein, blockchain laws in, world, in word and spirit. Thus, the users and companies' funds are segregated at LCX by law. Complete your KYC now. So yes, this is Monty Metzger. Let us look at, at into uh, look into his Twitter handle as well. First and first, let's see what he's saying here. As we prepare for the next up market cycle, let me share LCX company values, excellence, thriving in uh, to deliver outstanding products and industry leading platform, integrity, strong moral principles, doing the right thing when nobody's watching, unity or LCX community shaping the future of. For money and finance together consisting of passionate users clients partners and our team let us look at uh, Mont Monty Metzger's uh, account as well to see what uh, latest news we've got in terms of LCX okay we saw this the organization is potentially a big deal two hours ago two hours ago automation and efficiency I, I, I'm glad that he does regular updates this is good guys gives us more material <laughs> Automation and efficiency, smart contracts bring automation to complex processes. This means reduced manual work, lower chances of error, and faster transactions. All these benefits directly translate to cost savings, tokenization at LCX. LCX leading the charge, tokenization is redefining how we perceive and engage with financial services. The future looks tokenized. Okay, cross-border transactions. Tokenization can facilitate smoother cross-border transactions by reducing reliance on intermediaries and embracing a universal digital approach. Global trade becomes simpler. Global trade, asset liquidity, tokenizing assets can become them uh, can make them more easily tradable and accessible. Whether it's real estate, art, diamonds like diamonds or other traditionally illiquid assets, tokenization can unlock value. The rise of asset tokenization, revolutionizing financial markets. LCX, LCX becomes first to launch revolutionary NFT project Simons, ensuring contractual enforcement and uh, liability as physical validator. Trade real world diamonds on the blockchain. So yeah, so basically the diamonds are physically stored. You guys can check this, check diamonds out. Uh, like I said, tokenization is the process of issuing a digital representation of an asset on a blockchain. At Cardano Summit 2023, I will be speaking about tokenizing real-world assets for a digital future. You guys can check this out. As well, Cardano Summit. LCX is a sponsor of the Cardano Summit 2023 this year. So yeah, guys, uh, this was the LCX update. We uh, I'm glad that uh, the CEO is always involved in updating the community as usual. Now let us look at what uh, Alliance Block has been up to. Alliance Block Nexera. So yeah, this is the uh, official handle of Alliance Block. 19 hours ago, DeFi has been consumed by tokenized RWA narrative lately. Galaxy HQ, a digital asset uh, and a blockchain leader, just rele released an in-depth report looking at the forces propelling the growth of this narrative. Let's have a look at and see where Nexera stands. Uh, so let us check this out, see more replies. Firstly, real-world assets, RWAs are growing very fast. It has proved to be the fastest growing category of assets in decentralization in decentralized finance. Total value locked in this category has nearly doubled this year, growing from $1.4 billion to $2.5 billion. This growth has been linked to shifts in the global economy. Rising interest rates coupled with the crypto asset bear market have increased the attractiveness of traditional yield-generating instruments such as U.S. Treasuries and private credit. In the first three quarters of 2023, there has been a $1.05 billion increase 
$850 million has come from different sources like treasuries, real estate, and private credit. Some of the largest financial instruments and asset classes from TradePy are now being uh, represented as RWA on chain. Check this out. Asset type, gold plus precious metals, equities, carbon offsets, treasuries, and other bonds, real estate, private credit, yeah, share of RWAs, value of RWAs. Projects guided by RWAs fulfill one or more of the following activities. The acquisition of assets in the real world, the tokenization of these assets on-chain, the distribution of RWA tokens to on-chain users, Alliance Block and their technology stack have two and three covered. Alliance Block have positioned themselves as the experts in building the infrastructure of a decentralized tokenized market with Nexara positioned in the middle. And Nexara has an extremely good use case, utility in the middle, in the midst of things. The success of RWA tokenization lies in four critical components, infrastructure, liquidity, liquidity, compliance, and exchange. Alliance Block has built a com comprehensive ecosystem over the last five years catering to these. Uh, Rashid defines them in a recent uh, tweet. RWA tokenization is a current hot topic, but what often goes unspoken is that the actual tokenization process is the straightforward aspect. What generally defines the pathway to success are the four critical components that encompass it, the four ones, infrastructure, liquidity, compliance, and exchange. Momentum for RWAs will continue to grow in 2023 with the value of these assets trending towards all-time highs. Alliance Block and uh, Arc, Arc Banks are adding to this growth with the Arcify platform enabling users to seamlessly invest in RWAs. Check here. To be kept up to date with all the developments in the tokenization of RWAs, make sure to follow our official Telegram announcement channel. Okay, so you guys saw that how RWA is becoming the next narrative, next big narrative, and Anexera is in the midst of them all. Check this out. Spoolfy recently chatted with uh, Rashid in an X space hosted by media partner Genfinity.io. Below you'll see how Nexera offers the flexibility for compliance tailored specifically to financial institutions. Compliance is not one size fits all. It needs to adapt and work with individual states. Nexera gives us this flexibility. The power behind the tool is that it offers our clients and financial institutions mainly. <coughs> Sorry guys. This ability to be compliant wherever they're operating. You can find a curated recap of their conversation here. Genfinity X Space with Alliance Block founder and CEO Rashid, uh, Rashid Ajaja and Spool Protocol's lead builder Simon Shaber. Archify ever considered investing in RWA tokenization. Here's why you should. Okay, why, sh why should we invest? Here's why we should. Low risk, it, minimizing, it minimizes fraud, theft, or loss of risks. Uh, loss risks. Plus, get fractional ownership and protection via smart contracts and blockchain tech. Impressive ROI. Access high-value assets like uh, works by artist Dan Wu and enjoy the liquidity and efficiency of the crypto market. Inclusivity. RWA tokenization lowers entry barriers to exclusive assets, making them affordable. Invest with as little as $100 and diversify your portfolio. Interested. Powered by Alliance Block, we're at the forefront of decentralized tokenized market infrastructure. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, another great space by Genfinity IO. Don't miss this one. It is uh, in two hours. You guys can check this out. Generation Infinity Utility Overload. Uh, he, he, I think he's talking about HBAR, Casper Network, DAG, Nexera. So yeah, these are most of these coins that we all usually regularly discuss on our on in our channel. You guys can check this out. Play recording one hour forty seven minutes uh, long. Uh, okay, Spoolfy and their lead builder Simon Shaber recently chatted with Rashid in an X space hosted by Media Partner. Okay, okay, we saw this. You can find a curated recap of their conversation here. You guys can check this out. They've got uh, this recap as well. Uh, rather, let me open it. Let me check this out. Medium Alliance Block October 5. Okay. Alliance Block founder and CEO Rashid and Spool Protocol's lead builder Shaman Shaber joined King Solomon in the recent Genfinity moderated X space. Solving institutional DeFi challenges, the unique role of Spool and Nexera. Uh, simplifying DeFi for institutions, user friendly and automated solutions. 
privacy preserving compliance, a regulatory shift for DeFi. These are the topics, you guys can check them out in detail, you guys can read this out. Empowering institutions, spool seamless integration with the Alliance Block. The partnership between Alliance Block and Spool Protocol will help drive the adoption of institutions into a compliant DeFi. Uh, Spool's innovative middleware solutions, their smart walls, and their automated and optimized DeFi yield generating strategies marry perfectly with the vision of Alliance Block and Nexera by combining the innovative features of the recently launched Nexera exchange and the robust adaptable Nexera ID. Both parties will be able to cater to the needs of institutional grade investors. What is Spool? Spool is basically the next generation of DeFi investment infrastructure. It lets institutions easily create new investment products and investors manage a portfolio of automated risk managed assets in a single location. Spool was established as a DAO with a selection of founding contributors representing a diverse cross section of the blockchain community. So guys, this was Alliance Block, Nexera. We went through the updates, what is happening in with the Nexera their official handle let us now look into sologenic and corium uh, they are also huge on tokenization so this is sologenic let us look at what uh, the official account is saying i think that they don't usually update that much uh, as they should so we're going to be looking at what the community is saying join us with mike uh, mikoski as we discuss the tokenized future Okay, so yeah, this is good. 25 minutes long. Sologenic institutional tokenization. This is a good topic. You guys can check this out. So yeah, I take this back. They've been <laughs> updating recently. A, okay, Sologenic's co-creator Bob Brass X went uh, live on Nasdaq earlier today. Why the tokenization of traditional assets is poised to become a multi-trillion dollar industry. industry. So you, you guys can check this out as well. Tokenization is taking the real world assets like the stocks, ETF, or even it could be uh, real estate on, on blockchain, on chain. And uh, you know, once we are tokenizing assets on, on, on blockchain, it's going to give us a lot of uh, benefit and it's going to solve a lot of problems that there are existing within the traditional financial market, which probably we can touch base on that during the interview. Right. So yeah, you guys saw the co-creator of Sologenic, Bob Press, talking about tokenization. You guys can check this out. Uh, okay, Sologenic was at BPA panel series, institutional partnerships led uh, Mike McCuskey, joined fellow innovators from Deloitte and Elgo found at Elgo Foundation and Digital Assets, an active collaboration initiative between institutions and regulators. Join the upcoming AMA to learn more, Sologenic at Boston Blockchain Association. This is Mike McCluskey, Head of Strategic Partnerships. Set a reminder, yeah, you guys can check this out. Sologenic, the XLS39 proposal has been making waves throughout the XRP community. Should institutions be able to claw back funds from users or does this go against the pillars of crypto? The clawback feature, industry commentary. Calling all XRPL projects and developers, learn how to generate a, a, an API key and integrate the Solodex wallet to seamlessly interact with the Sologenic ecosystem. So check this out. Direct trading. Okay, so this is the wallet, Sologenic wallet, DEX wallet. The UAE has led the way in emerging XRP technology. Learn how the teams at Ripple and Sologenic are making an impact in the MANA region. You guys can check this out as well. XRPL hub in Dubai, industry commentary. 
So guys, let us look at what uh, Corium has been up to. Corium is the layer 1 blockchain and uh, it was built to enhance Sologenic basically the tokenization that Sologenic was doing regarding stocks and others they needed, needed their own layer 1 to fully function, function. so Corium is that layer 1 it is a wrap for EBC9 the team solidified Corium's presence as a leading innovator in the space delivering powerful insights on stage and forging impactful connections full recap and videos from the Corium presentations coming up so yeah Coming up, unveiling the DeFi trends of tomorrow, head of growth made by Fave.io and uh, developer re developer relations engineer Helwan underscore Mand to take, uh, take the stage of an exciting panel discussion, unveiling the DeFi uh, trends of tomorrow. You guys can check this out. Corium main stage, October 26th. Okay, so I think this was, this was it. It's a wrap. Uh, I think this full recap and videos. No, I think this is something else. This is the European Blockchain Convention, guys, powered by Corium. So they they have uh, sponsored that this event. Great first day at E Blockchain Con with a lot of participation at Corium's hackathon. Yeah, the EBC hackathon kicked off today in Bar at in Barcelona with an in-depth session on all about building on Corium. Hackers got a chance to work closely with the team on their submissions. Cool. Find the Korean booth uh, tomorrow and claim an exclusive soulbound token. What does it mean to be ISO 2022 compliant? Here's a deep dive into Korean's compliance capabilities, tapping into a, a, new, a new era of financial messaging. Yeah, this is cool. Let us uh, check this out. Let's read, the, read more of it. This is interesting, ISO 2022 compliance with Korean, a new era in financial messaging. This was posted three days ago. Uh, let us check this out. What is ISO 2022 and how institutions handle financial messaging? ISO 2022 is not merely an industry standard, it is a global language for financial messaging. It defines a framework for the development of financial message standards, making it a linchpin for the interoperability in the financial sector. These standards facilitate the exchange of structured financial information, enabling seamless communication between institutions, both nationally and internationally. Traditional financial uh, institutions have navigated a labyrinth of legacy systems and property centers, leading to inefficiencies and discrepancies and added costs. So this is ISO 2022, check this out, this Swift MT, technical terms, ISO 2022 and the blockchain, Corium's unique approach, Corium's EGP takes center stage as the first of a new generation of blockchains expressly tailored to meet the stringent, stringent demands of the enterprise world while steadfastly adhering to ISO 2022 compliance. This compliance heralds a new era of financial messaging and uh, solidifies Corium's position as a pioneer in the realm of blockchain technology. At the heart of Corium's EGB features is the revolutionary optional KYC component. This groundbreaking attribute uh, allows for a dual approach in transactions. On one hand, one hand, it preserves the essence of blockchain technology with anonymous peer-to-peer -peer transactions, making it ideal for DeFi protocols. On the other hand, it ushers in a new level of transparency and regulatory compliance for financial institutions. Okay. Another facet that distinguishes Corium is the introduction of smart tokens, a testament to Corium's commitment to providing customizable and flexible tokenization. However, Corium's quest for innovation doesn't end there. An unwavering commitment uh, to interoperability is woven into the very fabric of the network. These are the use cases that leverage ISO 2022 compliance. Settlement, the ISO 2022 standard streamlines the settlement of financial transactions, enabling faster, secure, and cost-effective settlements. Cross-border payments, infrabank transfers, neobanking, embracing the future of global financial messaging. In the era of ISO 2022 compliance, Corium is pioneering the future of financial messaging. As leading fintech consultancy firms audit the network, Corium continues to ensure that its blockchain is well prepared to address the complex challenges of the financial sector. So this is great, guys. Corium is... Uh, definitely meeting those standards those high international and global standards so this is a really good project and uh, so it uh, basically Corium and Sologenic complement each other well so guys this was Corium and speaking of ISO 2022 let us uh, check out uh, our last uh, coin in this uh, video last but not the least ISO 2022 integrated IOTA 
so yeah let us look at what iota has been up to <coughs> 44 minutes ago discuss, discover the power of slot commitment chains in iota 2.0 learn how these cryptographic commitments synchronize our dlt resolve forks and drive consensus finalization explore this key feature for a reliable and scalable decentralized network Discover the story behind Bloom from our roots with IOTA Foundation to what's next uh, on our roadmap. October 26th, exciting to see IOTA featuring as one of the top 10 crypto in the FTSC Grayscale Utilities and Services Crypto Sector Index by Grayscale. Check it out. Yeah, check this out. Features, coverage. 350 crypto assets are represented, classified, and made available in the starting universe across the FTSC Grayscale Crypto Sector Index series. Uh, IOTA is one of them. Objective to measure the performance of crypto assets that seek to deliver practical and enterprise level applications and functionalities. So this is huge for uh, IOTA. Obviously IOTA is providing those uh, enterprise level applications and functionalities. Index inclusion. The FTSC Grayscale Crypto Sector Index series was designed to ensure mutual exclusiv exclusivity across all assets. The FTSE Grayscale Utilities and Services a Crypto Sector Index delivers unique crypto assets uh, specific to the index objective. Cool. INATBA launches its new industrial blockchain task force uniting blockchain specialists from public and private sectors. Join us in the empowering uh, us in empowering the industrial decision makers and shaping the future of blockchain and AI powered resilience. IOTA head on over to the wiki entry to find more details on how network congestion in IOTA 2.0 is handled. Specifically, we describe the scheduling policy for incoming blocks and how to set the cost and mana of the, a new block. The complete reference for IOTA. IOTA community, you are amazing. We need just another 4 million IOTA voting to reach the needed participation so that the proposal initiated by the Tangled Treasury will pass. Get out uh, Get out those ledger. This the earlier the better. Two days left to show strength of IOTA. Vote in Firefly. Check this out. This is October 24. C E C Tech uh, 2023. More event photos during this four-day C Tech conference. In addition to hundreds of uh, visitors from various industries visiting the IOTA booth, it was particularly significant that the UAE M Tokyo also visited the booth to hear my presentation on IOTA. Along with uh, Yubla Sorg and Lama Risk, IOTA jointly responded to IOSCO uh, Press, SCO Press, DeFi report, emphasizing the need for customized regulations. We advocate against traditional securities, laws for DeFi, in depth insights in the comprehensive paper. Thank you, Kovai 1995 and team, for, for representing IOTA at CTEC. So basically, IOTA. Uh, was present in CTEC. We were honored to take part. CTEC 23, 2023, UAE. Check this out. Understanding congestion control, regulating access in a permissionless system. This is great. IOTA regularly updates the community and the investors, guys. So this is IOTA, the latest updates uh, of IOTA, validators in the IOTA 2.0 protocol serves as the backbone of the consensus mechanism. Their role is indispensable, encompassing various responsibilities. Anyone can step up to become one. So here's how. Let us check this out. Okay, okay, so I think you have to visit it to check this out. So guys, this was uh, IOTA. Now let us look at the prices of these coins that we covered the group four first and foremost let us begin with the lcx guys what what the uh, lcx has been up to in the market oh, okay lcx is down 2.4 percent uh, uh, if you look at the daily chart let us look at the 30-day chart what uh, lcx has been doing in the last 30 days so yeah, it has been consolidating basically guys, 0 0.039, 0 0.040, 90 days. Yeah, I think LCX has been consolidating at these price levels, so nothing much at the moment. Let us look at uh, Nexera. I haven't checked it out in a while, so let us look at what Nexera has been doing. Okay, Nexera is down 0.6% uh, in the at the time of the recording, 0 0.065622. Uh, Let us look at the 90-day chart directly. 
so basically Nextera is up from 0 0.04932 it has gone all the way up to 0 0.077329 and it has come down and I think uh, t testing these support levels over here this these levels 0 0.064 and this range and it is I think uh, might go back up because the it has got a good rebound from these this range this is Nexera let us look at uh, Sologenic now so Sologenic is basically down 3% in the daily let us look at the 90 day chart so yeah it is up 0 0.09 it is up from 0 0.09 it has gone all the way up to 0. Point, uh, so sorry 0. Point, yeah 0. 0.149120 and it has since th that time come down to 0. 0.11794 let us look at 180 day let us look at are there support range are there is there any support over here yeah, I see this uh, 15 May 2023 support over here, 0 0.116. So I think it one one it has gone down from that, but I think it might rebound from these levels. There is a chance that it might rebound. Let us see where this goes. So let us look at Korea. Corium is also down 3.5%, 0 0.080848. Let us look at the 90-day chart. So yeah, Corium is also, I think, uh, within a range. Check this out. It went from 0 0.075 to 0 0.089493. Since that time, it has come down again. And uh, th these are good support levels, 0 0.08184, 0 0.08. So these are good levels to watch. You guys can check it out. And even if we look at the all-time chart, guys, so I think it is extremely, extremely down from its all-time highs. So it might be a good entry if you're interested in Korean because it is an ISO, it is ISO 20.0 compliant, a layer one, uh, innovating tokenization, and uh, it is a good project in my opinion. Uh, not financial advice, obviously. Now look at uh, let us look at IOTA. IOTA is also down 2.7% in, in the daily. The basically the bull mark, uh, the uh, the rally that happened due to Bitcoin. Uh, now I think that is dipping at the moment. 0 0.153379. Let us look at the 90-day chart. Yeah, it went from 0 0.141581 to 0 0.156469. It is it has dipped a little as well I think uh, not much but a little if you look at the 90 day chart guys so I think uh, it is way down since uh, 7th September 2023 it was at around dollar 0.184398 yeah let us look at the all-time charts as well guys because at the, at the in the looking at the long-term perspective it is way down, extremely way down, and you might be wondering why this is. Internet of Things as a narrative is yet to come, guys, and when that happens, that narrative is going to be taking this to higher highs, in my opinion. So it is ISO 2020 compliant, uh, working with enterprises. So IOTA is a good long, long run project. Uh, when the Internet of Things narrative happens, it is going to be looking at uh, the highs. So guys, this was it for the video guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, make sure to like, share and subscribe. And if you're interested in any of these coins guys, we do regular updates, discussions, news regarding them. Make sure to uh, stay tuned and subscribe to the channel as well. And like I always say at the end of the video folks, until next time, stay blessed. Thank you very much.